Have you ever pondered on what it means to be truly alone, in isolation, detached from the world? The concept of solitude, its haunting allure and crippling despair, is a universal human experience transcending boundaries of culture, time and space. It is this profound question that forms the bedrock of a literary masterpiece, Metamorphosis by Franz Kafka. A tale that is as bizarre as it is deeply empathetic, Kafka's narrative is a poignant exploration of isolation and loneliness. In the heart of bustling Prague, a man wakes up one day to find himself transformed into a monstrous insect. Thus begins the grotesque journey of Gregor Samsa, our protagonist, and his descent into the abyss of solitude. Kafka, with his uncanny ability to blend the mundane and the macabre, paints a vivid picture of the human condition, stripped bare of societal pretense. In the labyrinth of Kafka's metamorphosis, we delve deep into the realm of isolation and loneliness. Meet Gregor Samsa, the protagonist of our narrative, who wakes one morning to find himself transformed into a monstrous insect. This bizarre metamorphosis is not just a physical one, but a metaphorical shift that mirrors Gregor's psychological isolation. Before his transformation, Gregor is a dutiful son and brother, sacrificing his own desires to provide for his family. Yet despite his selflessness, he is disconnected, misunderstood and emotionally isolated. Post-transformation, this isolation is amplified. His appearance becomes a physical manifestation of his psychological loneliness. His family, once the recipients of his care, now regard him with horror and revulsion. The creature that Gregor has become serves as a stark barrier, further separating him from human interaction and intimacy. Gregor's monstrous form only serves to accentuate his pre-existing loneliness, pushing him further into the abyss of isolation. As Gregor's condition worsens, so does his isolation. His family's fear and disgust only intensify his solitude. There are stark moments in the narrative that highlight the brutality of Gregor's isolation. The most poignant, perhaps, is when he is locked in his room, alienated from the world he once knew. He becomes a mere spectator, watching his family grapple with their new reality. His sister, Greta, initially shows compassion, but even she eventually succumbs to the repulsion. Their mother, too fragile to handle the sight of him, faints whenever she encounters him. His father, the most hostile, sees him as a monstrous burden. Gregor, once a breadwinner, is now a subject of dread. His transformation has stripped him off his humanity, leaving him utterly alone. The family's lack of empathy only deepens his loneliness, pushing him further into the abyss of despair. In the end, Gregor's isolation is not just physical, but emotional and existential. In the finale of this tragic tale, Gregor, succumbing to his isolation, passes away completely disregarded by his family. The poignant scene of Gregor's demise is not just an end, but a stark illustration of the devastating effects of loneliness. Kafka paints a grim picture where isolation is not merely physical, but emotional too, seeping into the very soul of the character. Gregor's transformation into a creature, his subsequent isolation and eventual death, all underline the inescapable reality of alienation in modern society. Kafka's narrative is a powerful commentary on how isolation can lead to dehumanization and indifference. The death scene is not merely a plot device, but a symbol of the ultimate consequence of loneliness. Gregor's life ends in an empty room devoid of warmth, love or companionship, a cruel reflection of his isolated existence, his death serves as a stark reminder of the human need for connection and empathy. In Gregor's death, we witness the ultimate consequence of isolation and loneliness. The Metamorphosis is a haunting tale, a stark reminder of the devastating effects of isolation and loneliness. As we delve into the world of Gregor Samsa, we encounter a man, now an insect, ostracized from the world he once knew. His transformation, both physical and emotional, is a clear depiction of the stark reality of isolation. We witness how Gregor's existence, once integral to his family's survival, is reduced to a mere inconvenience. His family's apathy and indifference towards him only deepen his loneliness. This brutal portrayal of isolation serves as a stark reminder of how society often alienates those who are different or misunderstood. Furthermore, Kafka's metamorphosis holds a mirror to our modern world where feelings of alienation and loneliness are all too common. It compels us to reflect on our understanding and treatment of those who are different or struggling. In the end, Kafka's metamorphosis is not just a tale of a man turned insect, but a profound exploration of isolation and loneliness. 
a theme that resonates with us even today.